What's going on guys? Aaron with Lansing Lawn Service. Today I am doing a trimmer versus edger 2.0. A couple years back I did an edger versus trimmer video. It did really well on the YouTubes, but here's the thing. I decided we need to do a 2.0 because I've got a new edger and a new trimmer. Let's check them out. So this is the trimmer and edger that I'm going to be using. This is an SRM 2620 from Echo. It's got the Darwin's grip, but that doesn't really matter anything. And I took the guard off of this one. This is a PAS system, an SRM 2620 with the curve shaft edger. Here's what we're gonna do. I am going to time both the trimmer and the edger. We're gonna run the edger. We're gonna time it to see how fast it gets down to that end. And then we're gonna run the trimmer from that end down to this end. We're just gonna see how long it takes each. All right, and our timekeeper is gonna be my beautiful wife, Renee. Hi. And we're gonna see how these two stack up because they're the same thing. Just one's an edger, one's a trimmer. And I know that you guys have your own opinion on which one is better. So let's find out. Okay guys, so I've got my son Marcus down there. Wave, I don't know if you can see him on camera, but he is going to raise his hand when I get to the last crack in our little uh, edge there to signal my wife, Renee, to stop the clock. And she's gonna let me know when to start. I'm gonna gear up here. I've already got my glasses on. Got to wear your ear protection. Always wear protection when you're running an edger or a trimmer, all right? Let's get to the race. Three, two, one, go! That was like going to the dirt track races. All right, now I'm gonna take the trimmer and we're gonna go down there. She's still gonna tell me when to start, but let's get it. Three, two, one, go! All right, guys, so let's take a look at the work that we just did before we see the times. So this is the edger side. Very nice, very straight. Of course, we haven't blown it off yet, but that's what it looks like there. This is the trimmer side. I don't know if you can see that. It's not as clean, but it's fairly clean. I got a little wide here and here at the start. I actually ran into this wire here. I forgot about that. So check out this edge. Now you'll notice there isn't as much dirt here as there is on the edger side because I don't go down very far. Here I went a little, little uh, shallow. And then it goes back in and back out, back in. It kind of straightens out and then back out again. So not super straight because I was trying to go super fast to really make this a good race. But you can see when you're trying to go fast, it's pretty difficult to get a really straight edge with a trimmer. All right, Renee, what are the times? What's the time for the edger? So the edger, 15 seconds, 0.49. And the trimmer was 20 seconds, 0.31. So I think we all kind of knew that that was going to be the outcome. However, I know a lot of guys like to use the trimmer for edges that are already existing. These edges were already existed. It was just overgrown. I haven't edged in like two weeks or something. You can see the difference. I mean, I really hustled on the trimmer side. I mean, really hustled. And I'm good with a trimmer in an edge. If you go back and watch the former video of the edger versus trimmer video that I did a couple of years back, you will see that that is one crispy line that I did with the trimmer. However, this one wasn't as crispy because I was really hustling. I mean, 
wasn't I didn't even think about doing a good job. I was just trying to get down here as fast as possible. So you can see where I could just drop the edger right in the crack and just full throttle it all the way to the end. And with the trimmer, you can't really do that. You need to slow down, make sure that you're walking straight and that you're you're getting that crispy edge. Otherwise, you're going to make the property look like crap. <laughs> All right, guys, the cleanup is done. Still looks pretty sharp. I mean, it's not the best, but it's okay. Let's take a look at the edger side. So this is the edger side. Got a little thing here. The cement kind of jumps out here. And so the edger jumped and kind of made a gouge there. But other than that, it looks pretty tight and crispy. Pretty nice. Now let's look at the trimmer side. So this is the trimmer side here. Starting out, we, we were a little wide there and got a little wider there. And we're coming on down and it's just not super straight. We got some strands of stuff hanging over just not the best. So here's another look at the trimmer side. It is quite hairy. There is some grass that's hanging over like here. Just doesn't look as good as this side here. So my conclusion is that the edger obviously does a way better job than the trimmer. Comment down below what you like to use. You can argue all you want. I don't care. It's clear the edger wins. I'm sorry guys. See you later. Peace.